guys so today we are exploring lynchburg we are going to the jack daniels distillery and this should be quite an experience <laughs> Everybody must know each other. And look behind me. These June roses are so pretty. And then over here, they have a county jail. Look how tiny it is. <laughs> like, this is so tiny. And then, yeah, this is pretty much the town. All of this is what I'm showing you is the town. At the distillery, and now we're gonna make our way inside. There's so much history here and the spot that it's located in is so beautiful. If you're somebody who's into nature, then you should definitely come and check this distillery out. Smell is your biggest tasting tool. If you see it smell, you see it taste. That's why you have a cold or if you're a kid, you your nose so you don't taste green peas. That's why it works. So smell deep. Smell deep. Open your mouth a little bit. When you smell, don't just use your nose. Use your mouth too. And if you want to agitate it, get Jack Daniels Distillery. It is amazing. I just got done doing the whiskey tasting and it's so good. Definitely a place you want to visit when you come to Tennessee. Hello my friends. So today we are doing the nearest green tour. This is his distillery and already I'm amazed because it's so beautiful in here.
things ever, candles. So let's go ahead and give a small test. That smells lovely. It smells like a boozy vanilla, a smoky boozy vanilla, and I'm definitely gonna get one of these once the tour is over. Oh, and it says on here that once you're done using it, you can use it as a whiskey glass. So, so far, this is giving me a really good impression. And then they have the liquor down there. Let me go take a look. So this is the liquor area. Look how beautiful this is. All the bottles are well lit. And I just like the vibe. It's very rustic. distillery as you can see so in six months to a year everything will look pretty much different I don't mind coming back and visiting and seeing a whole different scenery so that should be fun the great granddaughter of Nearest Green. And we have her here, here, super smart. You can tell it's in her blood, it's in her genes. And she was just named the 2021 Master Distiller of the Year. Take a sip, you waited long enough. finished with the tour amazing I highly recommend this place I heard about the story of Ernest Green about three months ago on the news and I can't believe that I'm here I didn't expect to be here but just to hear and see in person totally worth the experience totally worth the trip if you guys are ever looking for an experience to see on a beautiful whiskey distillery this is it this is totally it. It's so beautiful and it's changing up by the day. They're still building more in the back, so I recommend visiting in the next six months. Well, it's July, so probably in the next six months, around January, February, this place will look totally different. And I will totally come back just to see what it's going to be like. They're supposed to be building the world's largest bar. So that should be interesting. That really should be. So I definitely recommend this place. Amazing whiskey. Just everything about it, the tour guide was great. Everything, everything. Beautiful place to be. We're gonna get the 1884, and like I said before, look at this. Straight up beautiful. So he's gonna go ahead and get them for us. Okay, this is Payne. He was great today. <laughs> he helped us with our whiskey and checking in. So when you guys come, definitely check him out. He's pretty cool. Yes. <laughs> Do you wanna say something to my channel? What is it? Do you want to say something to my channel? Uh, come out and see us. For sure. It's history right here. Yes. History. History in the making. Yeah. 